Florida's governor releasing a new book tomorrow. Move many see as a first step that he'll announce his run for president soon. Hasn't happened yet, but it's the anticipation everywhere. WPTV's Matt Sesney in West Palm Beach with more on the early book reviews. A New York Times critic says the governor's new book lacks charisma and a sense of humor and reads like it was written by chat GPT. I doubt the governor will care much about that review since his supporters have already made the book number one on Amazon. I would expect so. There's been talk about it. Uh, and I expect to have people in tomorrow wanting the book. Candace Cohen, owner of the Palm Beach Bookstore, says copies of DeSantis's book, The Courage to Be Free, will be up front if anyone wants it. And that's likely to be people from one particular party. I think that's a smart thing to do, whether you're going to run for president or not, is say, hey, here's how I stood up to the woke mob, and you should follow my example. Peter Feeman is with the National Republican Committee in Florida and says the book offers some revelations, including a conversation involving Disney's CEO over the so-called don't say gay bill. The CEO of Disney admitted that he was getting pressure from employees and leftist organizations to fight the bill. And Governor DeSantis simply said, stay away, don't, don't get involved. And he didn't listen. Attacking the woke agenda, forcing change in education over CRT, uh, DeSantis lays out his policies that he believes are a blueprint for the country. Democrats see it another way. We've really got to be careful, Matt. The idea that the governor is talking about a blueprint for democracy when he's labeled freedom, but he's pretty much stifled freedom here in the state of Florida. DeSantis does have a book signing at the Palm Beach Convention Center Wednesday where questions will fly on if he's running for president. And there are hints, Peter Feeman says, as recently as a week ago. So I said, so, you know, what's on the agenda? Yeah. And he says, Pete, you ain't seen nothing yet. That was like, wow. The book is about 250 pages and sells for about $24. And that book signing event here on Wednesday, it's already sold out. In West Palm Beach, Matt Sesney, WPTV, News Channel 5.